eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Happy. I'm gonna kick your ass. Let's go. A lot of that shit. In a night. In a Monday night war. Last night. We had a pay for great people view last night. And bad blood. Not, not take over in your house. No, none of that shit. In your house shit. It was bad blood last night. In the pay per view. In one of the greatest pay per views of all time. With the return to Randy Orton. Brock Lesnar. Get these fireworks. I am talking. Shit. Welcome to the Monday Night War Headlines. Shit, my girl shut up, Jessica. It's Monday Night War. What's gonna happen after what happened last night? What? Oh, oh shit! Ooh, the aftermath of bad blood. And a mind and that hell in a cell match. Between Sammy Zayn and Kimberly Orton, a brutal Hell in a Cell match, a brutal pay-per-view last night. Brock Lesnar is back, return of his return last night, and attacked Stone Cold Steve Austin last night. Randy Orton with the return as well. We got the, you got the, the, the Beast, you got the Viper with the return last night. And a bad blood, a bad blood, bad blood, ah, bad blood paper. You know what I'm talking about. Randy Orton, who attacked Bobby Lashley, Bobby Lashley's pissed the hell off. And you know, you want to kick Randy Orton on the, the Viper's ass. And, and we have a big time tag match, a big time elimination tag match tonight here on Monday Night War. It's going to be a steel cage match as well for the tag team titles here tonight. It don't get bigger than this. It don't get bigger than this here tonight. And what happened last week with the Nexus? The, the Nexus! Way better than all those guys, the Nexus. A jumping John Cena last week. Rage Hell last week, the Nexus last week, and last night ECW showing up and attack Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn after that brutal Hell in a Cell match last night. There's so many, so much going on last night, so much going on last week, so much going on here tonight. Got yellow hair, blonde, trash hair, got a suit. <sighs> we get rid of this guy, McMahon, nothing like it. Why are you here, bro? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Earlier tonight, I told everybody that after the show, you're getting your money back. Unheard of. What? <laughs> Amazing. television, I said something very simple. No commercials tonight. Commercial free. Not bad. Never happened before. You know, the new general manager that Vince wanted to appoint, I'm not going to appoint the general. You know damn well. And I'm not going to give you your money's back at all. It's my day here today. To meet with my economic team about trade policy and major tax cuts and reform. 
We oh, are really you will pay uh, taxes. Oh, we don't give a damn if it's your birthday. This line pants. Stop, car. Stop! It's the back on JR! Stop costing Austin! This is the better than a night! We've got somewhat of a disagreement. So let me come out here tonight and ask two questions to settle this bill. Ask two questions here in Washington, D.C. No. I don't know. I don't give a damn about that suit. I don't give a damn about that piss haircut. You know, I don't appreciate the interruption of the former man who run the White House. Yes, I am here in this ring to inform you. Shut the hell up. I don't know what happened last night and bad blood or that some bitch Brock Lesnar showing up and beating me down last week. I just know that that punk bitch is has made a big damn mistake and I know I'm gonna raise hell and a can of whoop ass on his dinosaur face ass. <laughs> but right now, right now, you don't belong in this ring and talking that shit. Well, y'all don't have to give me a hell yeah. Well, it's going to be a, oh, hell yeah. Yeah, it's going to be a hell. I'm putting my foot straight up your... If you think of Donald Trump's going to win this match in Shea Vincent Man's head, give me a hell yeah. Ass. You stupid weirdo. Shut the hell up. I'm not done yet. You know, Donald, I don't think you're even formally introduced yet. My name is Stone Cold Steve Austin, you're standing in my ring. If you're standing in my ring, what I say goes. Do you understand that? You don't have to answer that because I hope you understand that. That's a good looking tie you got there. You doing okay? Look a little stiff. Glad to have you here. You know, lately, Donald, I've been seeing you on a little TV show, and all the only thing you got to say is, tell the people, you're fired. Let me tell you something. I'm going to tell Stone Cold Steve Austin. That. Get him out of here. Shit. I'm showing out after a great pay per view. I'm going to show him the bullshit. It's never going to work for you. Do you understand what I'm saying? I think it's only fair that you give a man fair warning. So I'm going to break it down to you like this. Not only in this ring, don't get under my skin. Basically, long story short, I'm telling you not to piss me off. Because if you do piss me off, I would gas. <laughs> yeah, Mister. Mister, I want to sleep with my daughter. Yeah. You didn't run shit. You didn't know how to run shit in the White House. And you damn sure not gonna run shit here in this ring. I don't give a goddamn if it's your birthday, if it's mother, if it's your mother's birthday, if it's your daughter's birthday, if it's your son's birthday, if it's tax day, if it's president's day. I don't give a damn about none of that. Just know that you're in this ring.
And just know that if you win this ring, you're going to get your ass kicked. <laughs> Yeah, that's it. Are we gonna have? Yeah, that's it. Stop, 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 St